Hello and welcome to our first Let's Play video for Baldur's Gate 3. Previously, I have played a little bit of Baldur's Gate 3, not a lot. I haven't completed any of the acts. I think there is three of them, though, in total. Um, I do have some mods, mostly cosmetics. I do not have any uh, added classes or custom races or custom spells added. Um... But yeah, hopefully you guys really enjoy the Let's Play series, and let me know what you guys think of it. Also, before we start, if you do not know, I do stream on Twitch every single day. And if you guys do like the Let's Play series for Baldur's Gate 3, I would totally be down playing uh, Baldur's Gate 3 on stream, where you guys can interact with the game while we're playing. I would totally be down for something like that. Um... But yeah, feel free to check me out. Click on the link down below. Drop a follow if you don't mind. It's always it's always appreciated, but you certainly do not have to. Other than that, let's get started. Yeah, we're definitely doing balanced difficulty. I cannot do tactician. I am not that uh, goated. All right, I'm not that good. <laughs> All right. Quality of the cinematic, so good. I bet all the cinematics look this high quality in this game. Look at that. The textures on his hands are phenomenal. Movie quality cinematics here. Oh, so good. That's so gross. That is so gross. I didn't want to see that. Mm. Mm. Yeah, you you keep on wiggling, buddy boy. Keep on wiggling. All right, I'm going to make a custom origin gonna go half elf so i'm going to make my character based off of me so i'm going to do a um elf i'm only picking half elf because they have more feminine looking um facial features in this game compared to the elves i feel like uh what class do i want to be though a wizard? I kind of want to be... Because I'm pretty sure you can have subclasses. And I would... I think I would want to be a... a f like a spell sword. You know what I mean? Like a fighter... Who's also a wizard. I'm going to start off as a fighter because I think that's going to be the easiest for me. When you make an attack with your offhand weapon, you can add your ability modifier to the damage of the attack. When you're wielding a melee weapon that is not two-handed or versatile in one hand and no weapon in the other, you can deal an additional two damage with that weapon. You can carry a shield in your free hand and still gain this bonus. Hmm. I 
think I'm gonna go rogue actually. I'll do like rogue and like maybe some like charisma magic. I'm not sure what class that will be, but um, I would like to do dexterity and charisma. I think here. Oh, so, what do I want to use? Um. I guess I'll keep Fireball. That's a pretty good starting one. Um, I'm gonna go Sage. I know Rogue and Sage sounds weird, but I like the idea of like dual daggers, but also being like a reclusive scholar in a library. You know what I mean? That sounds really cool to me. So Sage, you are a curious and well-read with an unending thirst for knowledge. Learning about rare lore of the world will inspire you to put this knowledge to greater purpose. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. Um, maybe we put it on charisma? Um, intelligence. Improved spell casting for wizards. Clerics. Okay, so this here, though, is Warlocks and Sorcerers. I'm probably going to end up being a Sorcerer or a Warlock. Probably a Warlock, I think. Or a Sorcerer could be cool, really. And this is for Druids, Rangers, Clerics. This is Wizards, so... We'll put 15 there. Constitution's up. Okay. Uh, let's change to this. Stealth and sleight of hand's good. Let's take that off. Persuasion can go up. Stealth will go down. Yeah. That sounds good to me. And then we'll edit our appearance. Hmm, what was that? That doesn't sound too bad. Um, eyes, we're gonna do red. We're gonna do hair. The hair may not be exactly like uh, mine, but that is a-okay. I can work with that. Uh, the hairstyle. I might like. that doesn't look too bad. I do want to see. That looks good. Maybe. We want it matching the skin color a little bit. All right, we'll do that. All right. Alright, we're gonna do elf. Uh I'm gonna give her this face. Looks super cute. Um And we'll do this hair. Yeah, it looks good. <laughs> hmm. 
I'm assuming that person is like the enemy. I take a wild guess. Mr. Tentacle Man, Squidward over here, putting things in my eyeballs. Yeah, he's not a good guy. <laughs> he's not a good guy. Oh, oh god. The dragon's about to eat her, or kill her. She's still alive. Okay, got little devils coming for us. Loot the body. Bloodstone. Dead. Good. Here we go. Alright, before I do that, I'm actually gonna wear or set up my uh my hot bar. So I can actually have my abilities uh, set up a certain way. I can do dip shove jump. Hide, throw, dash, help, 
and disengage. Or actually, yeah. We're gonna do it like this. There we go. We're gonna have melee on the top, bro. And then everything else at the bottom. on the right side. Yeah, it looks good. You made to go. Heard a voice. I think this is a, we can go up from here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. brain quivers in expectation oh. please before they return they return yeah. I don't know if it, I'm assuming it's the brain since we're literally looking at it <laughs> that dude is definitely not all right so I'm just gonna ask him why he's afraid <laughs> A newborn. Born new from this husk. You realize you're talking to an intellect devourer. A minion of the mind flayers who abducted you. Sure. Remove us from this body. From this case. Free us. Please. Sure. Wait. Uh, I don't know if I should free it though. I'll try, why not? Okay. I'm like still unsure if I should even free this. It might attack me. The brain lifts from the skull. But you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. Ah! I'm gonna commit to it. I saved it, I'm gonna spare it. I'm already committed. I messed up. I messed up. That thing is going to attack me. Something behind your eyes seizes in recognition. It's a brain of four legs, man. We'll go. We'll go together. Why not? It seems friendly. It's friendly. Somehow.
This is your end. Your head throbs and your skin tingles. Visions rush past. A dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Ugh. My head. What is this? Squaw. You are no thrall. Flakith blesses me this day. I'm not sure what Together, she is. We might survive. She looks like an orc. Uh... Yeah, I don't know if I'm trying to side with an orc, but uh, I'll ask who are you? Who am I? Your only chance of survival. Okay. First, Definitely an orc, dude. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. As for that thing, it will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. It may be of use in the fight to come. Oh, dude, that. That face, you just made is freaking adorable. So cute. I don't know. Maybe, maybe she is an evil. Who knows? Brain has claws, and that's it. Okay. This thing sucks. I am fury. I am death. It has it. I thought it was stunned. I have a bonus action. Think you can take me on? And away I go. Huh? Okay, it even hit him. Oh, nice. Wait. You proved surprisingly adequate in battle. Now, to the helm. What? Put our potion down here. Try to loot everything so I can sell it later. I I am a loot goblin. I just want you guys to know that right now. I am a loot goblin. I do two short sh swords. Wait. Okay. Here's things like not proficient. Okay. I am proficient with sword swords, so I'll keep that. Let's see what this does. radiates from the prisoners but they do not react All right. oh they reacted that time oh I thought I could push them in the middle
The only way out is through. Try me. All right. They did. Time for stragglers. That's a looks cute though. Le Lozelle. Person talking to. Look for a hash that might open the, the lid. Construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? I'll look around. There must be some way to get this. Kind of Shadowheart, okay. Okay, Shadowheart, I see you. The console appears dormant. The mechanisms are completely release? unrecognizable at first. Then you spy an empty socket. Nothing. The console remains dormant. <laughs> it just kicks it, yeah. That's gonna work. We just kick it hard enough. That socket must power this thing. On my way. It's something over here. Pick. Oh yeah. Plus seven bonus. Oh my. Brain in a jar. I think it might be in this room over here, maybe. Golden key. That sounds promising. How many hosts of these gay infected? Open up. Aldrich Rune. This might unlock those controls next to the pod. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Getting closer. I thought about pushing that. I don't know what it does, but I'm intrigued to see what it might do. The console appears dormant. Insert the room. The console hums to life. Arcana. Yeah, plus one bonus. Nice, we did it. Huge. Okay. The pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart. Than a machine. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Will the pod to open? We need a two. Just don't give me a two! Oh my. I have never. What? biomechanical brain of the console. A two, really? And reject it. Can I try again? Feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and reject it. No. Well, he's stuck. Can't believe I failed the two. Literally a roll for two, and I failed it. How? So unfortunate. We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. What if I don't want to? 
What if you're the bad guy? Huh? Oh, he looks dope. He looks... Oh. Oh, that's disgusting. Yeah, kill him. Let's go. He's like, eh, I don't think so. We will deal with the Geich after we escape. Connect the nerves. Nerves. We will connect them. Oh, oh. Looks like we're fighting the demons. Time to strike. I will move her first. Don't have an advantage. I'll try to take this one out first. Another trick up my sleeve. And then uh, here, pack this imp. God, he's strong. Time to press ahead. On the move. So we just need to reach the transponder. We don't need to kill the dude. At least I don't think. Time to strike. Hurry before they strike. I'm gonna stop him there. Now I'm gonna move them forward. To strike. Taking position. I actually might be able to kill this guy. Now thinking about it, I think I could kill him. No! I misclicked. No! That's so unfortunate. I'm gonna have you drink a potion. Just in case. I think we can actually kill this dude. Never mind, we are leaving. <laughs> he has reinforcements. How much health do they have? 82? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, never mind, yeah. No. I'm gonna attack him again, though. 
Yeah, that was a terrible idea. Path lies before me. Okay. We leave in this this place. This creature can't act. Oh no. <laughs> Small boy can't activate it. Rip. Oh, he's so low though. 48 health. I might uh, no no no. No, I'm gonna fight him. I'm gonna fight him. Death won't take me yet. I'm so indecisive. Oh, I should not have fought him. Yeah, yeah, we're we're just gonna leave. Peace. Curious. <laughs> I thought I thought I could kill him. Oh, why is it hurt? Oh, probably because I used her to click on the objective. Touch it. To oh. going to next another cutscene <laughs> She's staring at me like that. At least I landed on a beach. Nice and sandy. <laughs> As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Orient yourself, yeah. The chaos of the crash site confuses the landscape. You'll need to find a settlement or landmark, and you'll need to do it quickly. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. Moving in. Anything back here? Usually there's stuff behind you. Oh, guess not. What's inside? Angle fisher. Potion's nice. More for me. I'm gonna need that for alchemy later, I'm pretty sure. Shh. 
Shanties for the bitch queen. Wow. Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. I bet I can sell it. I bet I can turn a profit, okay? That's 14 gold right there. I, I am such a loot goblin, man. <laughs> I didn't think I was this bad. Oh, there's someone over there. Oh, there's not even anything yet. They can't hold forever. Blasted Dora! What? Stop! Not another stepper out! Wait. It's you. You're the one who tried to free me on the ship. Yes. At me. least you made the effort. Suddenly, you see what she sees, feel what she feels. Confusion, resolve, and a hint of gratitude. Uh, did you feel that? You've got the same thing I do, in your head. You. I didn't feel a thing, no idea what you're talking about. The mind swap I experienced before on the ship, you felt it too. I remember you survived those monster pods. Or pod, then. Yes. And they put a tadpole in my eye, too. I assume that's what caused our minds to... cross. But that's the least of our problems. These things are going to consume us from the inside and turn us into mind flayers. Oh! Well, I don't want that, so... You know about mind flayers. Tell me everything. I don't know much, but enough to be afraid. This is how they breed. We host their spawn, and once they're ready, they'll tear right through us. I'm not sure how much time we have left, but I'm not going to wait to find out. You and I need a healer. Finding one won't be easy in this wilderness. We'll need supplies. I'm hoping something... She knows what to do. <laughs> she got the plan. I like this. I've made a dent in it so far. Stand aside, I have lot picks and the skill to match. <laughs> By all means. I'm going to see what's <laughs> at the top of this cliff. Hopefully there's no more of these creatures along the way. It'd be a nice to have another hand to fight. Yeah, I want we'll her to company for our final moments. I want her in my party. Right. Whatever lies ahead will be a little less daunting with support. You can call me Shadowheart. I'm re I want to do the racial response, but I'll just do I'm Reiki Oho. Let's make haste. Alright. Ooh, and we leveled. Alright, I'm going to level before we lockpick that door. Rogue. Oh, that's literally it. That's literally it. There's... Nothing else. Shadowheart levels and get new spells. Okay. We'll take that off. Inflict wounds is good. Guiding bolt. Ooh, that's good. The next attack roll against this target has advantage. That will help with the rogue. Heal, heal. Um, Sanctuary is really good. I like that. All right, let me add or swap out um the non blue looking ones. All right. All right, I think that is it for our first Let's Play of Baldur's Gate 3. I will be continuing from here. 
Um, yeah, if you guys want to get notifications of when the next video comes out, just subscribe to the channel if you like. You certainly do not have to. And like I said before, we do stream on Twitch. If you want to visit and drop a follow there, it'd be much, much appreciated. But I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, Let's Play so far. I really liked it so far. I'm really, really excited to play the Rogue. Um, I'm really excited to get spells. Being a spell casting Rogue sounds amazing. And I have Shadowheart in my party. I'm not entirely sure what other companions I can get. But hopefully I can get a full party and uh, be able to get after it. Well, thank you again so much for watching this video, and hopefully you enjoyed it. If, uh, you know, let me know down below what your favorite class is and race. I would be very interested to see what everyone plays in uh, Baldur's Gate 3. Alright, until next time, see ya. Bye!